And if you think that gamers were toxic, oh, too bad. I got news for you, homies. And if you have seen any of these fellas on the internet, I, I mean, like, this is this is a crazy situation we have. But guys, we're not talking about BBC here, okay? We're talking BBC, but not like that BBC. We're talking about the British Broadcasting Channel. Guys, come on, man. Get it together, for folks. Get it together, damn it. But, ladies and gentlemen, if you have seen any of these fellas on the internet, let me tell you, man, you have been on the internet for way too long, though. Yeah, you have it. And that includes me as well. Like the video if you love your mama, guys, because today, suckers are beefing, man. Like, get your popcorn together, get your talkies right now, because suckers are beefing, beefing, beefing. Everybody beefing, 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 beefing. And, and in the video games, same bow squash. In the YouTube scene, same bow squash. But let's actually, you know... Keep it lighthearted. Let's see what's the problem is that. Let, let's see what's the problem, right? Shout out to the homie. Too lazy to try. All right, roll it. All right, so in this video, I'm going to be talking about Sneeko and Myron Gaines from Fresh and Fit and how they got carried away with trying to pander to a certain audience and how it backfired on them because it looks like now Sneeko might be starting to regret the audience he's cultivated. Okay. Like, it hasn't been going too well for him. And oh, recently, what? he had to break the news to his audience that he's not actually racist. Like, you're liberal now because you don't hate black people? Are you what? stupid? I've never hated black people. You switched up. Did you think that I was going to... Did you think that I was gonna be an uncle, an Uncle Tom in the big house for you whites? No, never. <laughs> what? I can't believe people like this is people thinking I'm attacking whites. What did Sneeko sell out? What? Did you think that I was a white supremacist? Look at me. But Myron, I don't think we'll ever. What? Bruh, like that is crazy though. Cause I remember my time watching Sneeko when he was on YouTube, right? And, and the craziest thing here is that like, let me know if you guys play Call of Duty or not, still play or played in the past because i remember anybody that started youtube back in the era right like around 2010s era started with call of duty on the on the youtube then some of them stuck still stuck with it and most of them kind of moved on started covering other games or branch out to real life content or red pill content black pill content i don't even know what's like black black pill white there's white pill there's blue pill there's uh what what, what other pills am i missing let me know in the comments guys but sneeko started with black ops 2 i remember when he was posting black ops 2 videos then he had like very humble beginnings man humble beginnings you know what i'm saying like we all have those humble beginnings humble beginnings and so did he had a humble beginnings right and, and yeah people can learn people can change that's perfectly fine it looks like that he's having another change though because after his humble beginnings he started making some banger content though and i, I and i love that I, I feel like that a lot of his fans uh initial fans original fans also loved it and then he had that red pill era and, and to be fair though I didn't agree with everything, but I kind of enjoyed it. I found it entertaining, though, you know? I found it entertaining with, like, the Bumbleclot sound effects and all that. I kind of, I found it, I'm, I'm gonna be real, okay? I'm gonna be real. I found it entertaining. Didn't, did not agree with everything, but found it entertaining. And he blew up like crazy on YouTube. I remember, uh, it was, like, around those, it was dark times, man. It was dark times, right? Uh, I, I remember, like, Andrew Tate was going crazy and all that. And then, of course, YouTube, everybody, all social media came together. Ban everybody, left and right. It was crazy. And after that, he went on rumble and ever since then i don't know much uh, that happened with him maybe he, he went through a positive change maybe not so much i don't know about it but one thing that i wanted to point out here is that damn man uh, too lazy to try i'm sure that's not him but but damn brother reacting too though like it, i think it's good to have a uh, jpeg as a reaction i mean that might be the new meta though that might be a new meta i've reached this point like he still is going hard trying to pander but he always just constantly humiliates himself in the process and it's hilarious i mean the guy is so desperate to convince people that he's based that he sucks up to white supremacists like he wants to be accepted by them so badly that he'll join myron is so embarrassing he's always simping for white nationalists and they treat him like dirt damn Join a whites only Twitter space and try to convince the people in it that he's just like them. As a brown man, I'm just sick and tired of everybody playing the race card, bruh. Like, what the? What, what is going on in the world, man? Like, damn, y'all suck is crazy. Y'all suck is be beefing over none, bro. Damn, this suck is crazy, man. Like, yeah, man, as a brown man, I'm, I'm sick and tired of everybody playing the race card, though. Which is so embarrassing, especially because they want nothing to do with him, obviously. Like, they're pretty open and honest about that by calling it whites only. It's not really a secret. But also, Myron, he does think of himself as a white guy. Some guys are what? different about it. Like, uh, some dudes are like, yeah, it's gonna be funny. Eskimo Brothers is for a funny yeah, story yeah, and yeah. shit. 
Um, but I, you know, and then some guys are like, health, you know, I've noticed with black dudes, they don't like doing that shit. White guys, we're all like, yeah, well, uh, I said we. Yeah, but not, <laughs> he's yeah. white. He's, he's white. white. He's white. <laughs> Justin. See, he's white. Hey, he ain't hey, hey, black, bro. Hey, hey man. That was natural. That was natural. <laughs> I officially just. Yo, 10 out of 10 reaction right there. <laughs> what? I mean, maybe slip of the tongue, right? Like, maybe slip of the tongue, guys. Maybe, what were what we thinking? What were we thinking? Or you guys think that, nah, man, it was deeper than that, though. It was deeper than that. I don't know, man, because, you know, Myron Gaines, uh, 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 there's another home, homie of his, uh, they do fresh and fit, right? And, and I'll be fair, bro, I, I've seen it, and I found that entertaining, too. I don't, listen, man, I don't agree, okay? I, I'm, I'm, a, I'm a very easygoing guy. I'm a very easygoing guy, guys. I, I don't take crap on the internet super seriously but you know what like abba and preach <laughs> and fresh and fit like you know what it, you, you just like how you cannot mix water and with the milk i mean sick still do it right like yeah they still mix water with the milk i guess that's gonna be a bad example but just like how you cannot mix oil it, with, with milk some of you will say that it's because i do that on that no don't say that okay just a metaphor I, I know it's bad but like come on now man so just like how you cannot mix oil with milk or oil with water, like why? Yeah, like forget what, what am I saying? Well, yeah, well, uh, oil with water, you cannot mix both of these fellows. Okay, these things are always beefing though, always beefing, beefing. So yeah, like I've seen, of course, I've seen the podcast, right? I tune in here and there, and <laughs> it's always it's hilarious, man. Like what? <laughs> this, this, yeah, this is insane, man. It is insane. So I never thought that, you know, Myron Gaines is gonna have. And apparently what we're hearing is that like Sneeko is turning on, but they are fighting. Maybe it's like behind the scenes, behind the scenes, they're all cool. And it's just for the content, you know, I right, go make the Benjis, it's fine. Just stamp Myron and his wife. <laughs> yeah. 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 What I meant to say, what I meant to say was when I was in college, <laughs> yeah, I knew that was coming. So when he joined the Twitter space, he's trying to kiss their ass and convince them that he's just like them. But of course that didn't work. And once he left, they're talking about him afterwards and they kept calling him the N word and saying, he promotes n-word behavior because and i agree with him like we gain nothing like one of these comes in they talk nice they're like oh look white people deserve their space and can't we just be friends and blah 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 did he say the n-word with the hard r oh shit oh shit oh shit bruh but then later that night they're just n behavior yeah, you, uh, I think it was you, Comfy, that was speaking hey. about that guy where he's like against the Jews and all that shit. And then a half an hour later, he's posting shit like, yeah, as many bitches as you can and just yeah. fucking nigga behavior. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, my oh, my God. God. Whoa, 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 whoa. Tranquilo, tranquilo. Hey, whoa. But it's lit, comfy hours. Whites only. <laughs> Damn, man. Damn. And yeah, okay, so Too Lazy to Try is uh, reacting pretty hard right there, too. So you got, uh, okay, we, we got, a, it looks like that we got more people here than playing Dustborn. You know the game that recently came up? Yeah, crazy, man. Myron Gaines. Yeah. Gaines. Yeah. Myron Gaines. The worst thing he said was, don't marry a girl until you're 35. What a yeah. retarded thing to Yeah, say. what a fucking idiot. Stupidest thing ever, mate. You know? This is why we're talking, this is what... This is what we were saying yesterday. Like, yeah. at the end of the day, they're fucking low IQ, they're low impact yeah. control. Even if you know yeah. they say a few things that are based or whatever by our standards, don't fucking fall for it. Don't think that they're on our side. Oh, based. Yeah. Yeah. You know, it's just, yeah. just you know what I mean. No. And Myron must just like getting humiliated because after this, he joined again and they just kept calling him the N word. They got into an argument and they eventually had to kick him out. Handsome Truth kicks Myron out of a wide only space, bro. Yo, 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 what is, what is going on? And this was last edited, 11, 19 a.m. Not sure what time zone though, that's important. Can be important, right, in the court of law. 9, 7, 24, from Earth. Oh shit, okay, oh man, damn. Oh, shit. That's a hellhole, right? Yeah, I recognize that place though. From Earth, crazy. Who, from Earth, man, that was tweeted by Earth. I'll oh, say you swear to God, man, damn, this thing is crazy. Hey, Myron, you're in a hostile area, And I'm not area, scared bro. to have Just... conversations with you guys because I'm not a pussy. Okay, well, you're going to have to either kick you're not me gonna out have a or whatever. You're not going to have a conversation with him, that's what I'm okay, trying to say. Okay, well, this dude's a f so whatever. British guy, you're like, dude, I know you're mad about 77. Mate, men, black men yeah. are like most hey, likely look, to hey, f*** out of black hey, men. Hey, you're hey, f***ing black. Kick this here. 
So he's just so desperate for the approval of white people. It's honestly kind of sad. Like, also, I think last year when he was on Sneeko's stream, he was wearing. Yo, am I, yeah. Whoa, hey, whoa, whoa, hey, hey, tranquilo, papi. Hey, papi, chill, papi. Hey, papi, chill. Damn, this thing is crazy. Yeah, I, I, I remember that moment. That was insane, though. Holy crap, bro. But, but I, uh, there's gotta be some history, right? Like, uh, I don't watch any of these folks religiously, though I sometimes tune in when I wanna lower my IQ, I wanna, like, you know, see, like, what's happening on the other side, you feel what I'm saying? You know, I just wanna be entertained and all that, and, and gain some wisdom, too. I feel like that there's always good in people, uh, I feel like that you can gain wisdom from everybody, man. For everybody, man, damn, you can always, uh, pick some good stuff from everybody out there, from everybody, even if it's, like, the most uh, evil person ever. I guess the the biggest would be uh, from that situation would be like okay the the confidence or he really believes in that crap even though if it's wrong you can be like okay so I gotta believe in myself for doing something right you know that that kind of thing right that kind of thing always believe yourself fellas so yeah you can always pick some good stuff from everybody but but I want to know like there's gotta be some history right like uh, Myron trying to be like white or be cool with the white maybe he thinks that he's not cool with the white maybe he like white people I, I guess that's fine that's fine i mean damn like that's fine right like that's fine man but saying that we white people okay he got caught with his pants down almost like that right but uh, yeah like there, there's gotta be history there like his slip of the tongue happens slip of the tongue happens so i'm not gonna hold him accountable over that but the fact that his community I guess his haters gonna do that for sure, like the haters gonna do that, I guess it makes sense. They always are ready to like, you know, they always ready <laughs> ready to switch up, they always are ready to do that. But if that is his community doing that, like if the if his own community is holding him accountable like that, then there's gotta be some history, something must have happened that we don't Your know. Clan or I don't know. Well, he's going off on Abba and Preach, and Nick Fuentes, he later joined the stream, and even he was like, damn, this is hardcore, even for me. I like that. <laughs> I like that. This video that we, we got these niggas running like it's an employment line. What the f? What? Don't do that. I will find you, you fucking stinky looking piece of shit. You go fucking find right here. I don't like you already. As a character. Th this, this is, this is not I was representative. Born this way, you chick. Keep going, chick. Come on. No, I don't think they do. So. You damn right, they're high value, man. They say more lives than your motherfuckers have. What the f you niggas? When y'all sitting there in that tight ass room, I'm sitting next to a fucking monkey with dreads for a decade. You Nick. That was a little hardcore. This is a little hardcore even for me. I'm glad you didn't show up in a in a white hood, Nick. That would have optics, you know? I was gonna do the MAGA hat, but it just it wouldn't go as hard as the white hood, so Nick, your followers are going to Myron now. You got competition. <laughs> That's true. I've been on the internet for way too long, guys. I've been, I need to, <laughs> but to be fair though, like, in my defense, guys, I don't know much about Nick, and I don't know much about this guy, uh, and I don't also know, like, the full history of both of these fellas, I know them, I mean, on the YouTube, right, but, like, I don't know much, okay, but still, man, I feel like that I've been on the internet for way too long, man, like, whoa, right, how many of you guys have been on the internet for way too long, and now you're realizing, shit, man, something ain't right, I know about these dudes way too much, right, like, yeah, any of you having that feeling, if you're like, nah, bro, like, I know none of these fellas, yeah, yeah, you're good, man, you're good, you're good. For both of you guys, both of you guys are, it's like, I'm being outdone, I thought I went pretty hard in November, you got, you and got it's Myron like, leading the dissident right now, uh, yeah, it's a couple of, it's an Albanian and a black guy, what the fuck? I heard that some of y'all were raising the salute, so I decided to come back. Let's go. <laughs> Poor Sneak go. <laughs> For all rolls out. Oh, come on. No! Oh, hey, 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 hey. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Chill, man. Chill. Damn, damn. And I feel like that uh, this one was uh, portrayed... Oh, uh, listen, man, I don't know the intention, okay? And I don't want to talk on his behalf. Because uh, the way I feel like that, it was seen, of course, like... You know, people wouldn't take that lightly for sure. And respect, man, if you... Yeah, you know, it's your culture. I can understand that you want to respect your culture. Oh, absolutely, right? Because some people don't even have a culture, or they do, but they don't even care. But if you care, respect, right? But I feel like that the fact that he's black and he's doing this uh, stuff... Yeah, it was. it's viewed as a comedic piece, right, to a lot of people. And that's fine, but some people don't take it lightly. Uh, that's fine too but you know in comedy it usually works well for example right like i'm pakistani so if i make jokes about my country my country people wouldn't be too mad some of them will be of course i'm just giving you an example right 
But for example, if somebody that is not from my country and makes fun of that, it's gonna rub different. It's gonna sound different, right? It's gonna offend people. Let's let me just put it that way, right? Y you feel what I'm saying? And same goes for let's just say America. If you so if you're an American, right? Like and you're patriot, patriot. Respect, respect. Now if somebody comes outsider comes in and tries to destroy your country, of course, if you're a patriot, you're gonna fight back. You're gonna be like, hey man, how dare you? you cannot do that, man. Like you cannot do this to my culture. You're gonna stay your ground. You're gonna stand your ground. Absolutely, respect, right? So it's like one of those things. But uh, the, the fact that he had a slip of a tongue, yeah, I feel okay. Now I'm, I'm getting a little, a little bit of some pieces. I, I see why people are going off right now on this uh, kind of situation. But guys, no, no, no. let's go. No, no, no let's no. go. We're down let's for do what happened. Let's do it. <laughs> oh, she yeah, so my iron is just she completely out of control. I mean, people think Sneeko's extreme, but even he looked kind of embarrassed about that. And he just seems like now he's starting to tone it down a bit. Like when Myron was on his stream recently, I think just last week, yeah, you that's tell Sneeko was not as into it. Like at one point, they're talking about that podcaster, Bobby Altov, and how she's been running around partying with athletes and rappers. And at first, they're both in agreement. They're like, yeah, she should be spending more time with her kids and her family. But oh, then Myron, damn. he had to take it up a notch. Single mom. Single mom, is that what's up, man? Damn, man. Like, single mom, man. Who's the baby daddy? Probably don't even know. Though. And he's like, yeah, and she's hanging around black people. And Sneeko's like, well, what's wrong with that? And then they kind of had a disagreement about it. And then eventually Sneeko's like, what was the deal with you in that whites-only Twitter space recently? Brutal. She's no. hanging out with two so it makes it even worse. Okay. Wait, what? These aren't Yeah, they are. What? This, she's Dominican. And wait, why is it bad that she's hanging out with black people? Yeah, Myron, tell us really? why. Yeah. Tell us why, Black Myron. girls are bottom of the totem pole, bro. Bruh. You want me to lie? Bottom of the totem pole of, of what? Because oh, she... everything. They're fat. They're okay, loud. Okay, okay, First off. They're obnoxious. I... They have wear fake hair. Okay, look, 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 man. Ding, 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 ding. I don't think they're fat, though. Yeah, I don't... They're probably not the, the most athletic. And that's fine, though. But they're not fat, though. I get it, like, strong independence is on the rise, man. I don't like that either, though. You know, I don't like that either. A strong independent, need no man. Men are always manipulating. Men are always wrong. But in this one, man, I think they are right. Like, you are trying to manipulate. Here. These both girls are both Spanish. They look black. Or half <laughs> They look like half breeds. <laughs> what? Yeah. What? <laughs> yeah, Sneeko and his redemption arc. I, I feel like that uh, redemption arc. I feel like that Sneeko's coming back. He's coming back. Uh, li listen, man. I always, uh, I always. Uh, this is kind of like me only. You guys don't have to agree or you guys don't have to follow. But for me, like on the internet, bruh, I don't take crap real. Okay, like uh, especially content like this. You know what? I don't take it literally, though, bro. Like I don't take it literally. I get it, though. You might, and that's you. That's you, though. I, uh, I don't want to change that. You know, you can disagree, you can agree. I don't want to change that because that's you, right? Stick with it. Or you can have, you can learn and grow. We all learn and grow. Opinions always change. I feel like that. that's what we're seeing with uh, with Sneeko because I feel like that. I've watched his content, right? I feel like that the Sneeko, uh, when he was like blowing up on YouTube with the red pill and stuff, right? I feel like that now he's kind of toning it down. I don't think he's toning it down because, because he already got banned on YouTube. So I don't think he's toning it down because... He would lose. I think he's just having a real growth with it, you know, personal growth. And I can respect that, man. We all can agree. We can all can, or I mean, we can all, uh, we can all have different opinions. We all grow, right? Uh, uh, thank you for subscribing, man. Appreciate it. Real quick, though, I just want to say, man, uh, before I forget, uh, shout out to the homie, the Brian, the social, the whole yeah! that yeah, one, Odd Boy, Silver, Captain BB, or Captain Controller. Oh, whoa, man, that's not Captain BBC. That's Captain Controller. Shout out to all of you homeboys out there, man for following on the Instagram. If you have the Instagram, I would definitely love to have you there. Links in description, links in the pinned comment. All right, let's get back to it, boo-boo. This one here is definitely, she's Puerto Rican. No, that bitch is black. This is a Puerto Rican and a black Dominican. Black and something, they're both mixed, bro. Bruh. You say this, I saw the, the clip of you, you got, um, you were in a whites only Twitter space and you got kicked out. Yeah, they didn't want to debate. Niggas got scared. Ah. Yeah. 
Yeah, so I think Sneeko might be regretting some of the people he chose to associate with. Yeah, they didn't want it to debate. They were scared. I, to be honest, though, that's a good response. So even though we know that did not happen, but that, I, I'll say this much, man. Like, you know, confidence, though. I like that. Yeah, man, it's not me. I mean, can be egotistical, absolutely. But you know what? Like, yeah, man, it, it's good, man. It, they just didn't want it to debate me. Okay, I like that, like that. Confidence there, Poppy. With... And then also later on during the stream, Myron's dog shit all over Sneeko's apartment, which is just <laughs> awesome. And then Sneeko went on to Fresh and Fit afterwards and got into a giant argument with Walter, which was absolutely hilarious. And I just talked about it on Patreon. Make sure you check that out after this video. There's so many good moments from it. It was really cringy. And it also made me realize I'm pretty sure Fresh and Fit is coming to an end soon. I mean, it seems like the whole red pill space is just kind of imploding at this point. And I wouldn't be surprised if Sneeko is starting to rethink his whole career because recently he's been getting a lot of shit from his fans and people he associates with because he's denied the idea that Damn. Haitian immigrants are eating people's pets in Ohio. What? And he's just been very pro Haiti because his dad's from there and he's been visiting there a lot recently. So after the presidential debate, when Trump said that the Haitian immigrants are eating people's pets, Sneeko put out the- hey, 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 hey. Whoa, whoa, hey, tranquilo, papi. I, I, to be fair though, I did not watch the debate. Uh, I need to, I need to maybe, I need to. Did he say that? Dang on, that's crazy. Is that real even? This tweet where he said the story's fake. And then he also put out another one where he said, soon the people will know the truth about the beautiful country of Haiti and posted a picture of himself there. And he just got absolutely annihilated in the comments. Oh my God. I mean, pretty much everybody was making Holy. fun of him, which of course- Aren't you Haitian? Do you eat cats? 67 IQ is considered clinically retweeted. Hate, Haiti has been completely now personally I've never been there I don't know much about it and I haven't been following I believe I, I heard the the news but uh, when the the president left the country but that was like a uh, kind of a while ago right so personally I don't know much I'm ignorant on the story so I'm not even gonna give my give you my opinion on this matter but all I, I'll say is that yeah on the, the news is sometimes real right but they overblow it like a hundred times more they make it look they make people specific countries look hundred times worse than they already is not defending Haiti or not attacking if that makes sense just trying to be real about it but but sheesh man like people I mean t to be fair though on Twitter everybody beefing but, but sheesh you know man. the people that follow him aren't going to be sympathetic towards Haiti or the immigrants from there and then the people that would be more sympathetic towards that obviously just hates <laughs> what is going on for the immigrants from there run guys <laughs> Cat, duck, emoji, and three black men running after them. Cat, this is AI generated, I know, but like, AI is really getting to that level, guys. AI is really getting to that level. Breath, stop, stop it. Haiti is a shy's whole country. Haiti uh, uh, was a shy's whole before Hillary stole a bunch of kids. What? there oh and then man the people that, is... that would be more sympathetic towards that obviously just hate sneeko and are preying on his downfall so everybody's just piling on here you know he's getting destroyed and this made him rethink his whole opinion on white supremacy a country that was built by white people by white supremacy if it changes from that there's going to be absolute mayhem if you destroy the ethnic majority if you destroy the ethnicity that created the country, you destroy the essence of it. White people created America. And it, like this narrative that like, well, Chinese people built the railroads. Who hired the Chinese people to build the railroads? Well, slaves who, bro, slaves, they picked some cotton. Slaves didn't build America, white people did. They were the engineers, the designers, the one creating all the deals. White people created America. White people, Amer Uni the United States of America, is a white country. It was built by white people. It was created by white people. This is, should be a white country. When was this ever a white country? When, like for a couple of years, what the founding fathers, and then all these immigrants poured in immediately? White supremacy is white Zionism. It's the same exact thing. Uh, uh, maybe, maybe, I, 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 I think that he's having, you know, personal growth. <laughs> I think that's what we're not gonna give a give a full down to Marco there, but I think his opinions are changing. Like I think he's growing as a person. I think that's what's happening right now, man. That's what's probably happening, man. Hey, man, listen, man. Hey, man. <laughs> Yo, that is insane, man. Like, listen, man. Sheesh, man. Holy crap, bro. Like this drama, crazy, man. I'm all up for personal growth, man. We all, yeah. I was, 
But, but, man, damn, man. This thing is crazy, bro. This thing is crazy. But all that fair. He's having personal growth by the looks of it. Okay. Wanting to have a, a white-only nation is not a white country. It's never going to happen. It's never going to happen. I'm sorry. I don't know why people are even trying to get this. It's, that will never occur. Bro, you guys would f*** Hitler if you could. You think being a... Like, you worship the fact that you're Aryan. It's it's really... It's getting weird. It's getting weird. Do you think that being white is an accomplishment? We was Aryans and shit. Stop sucking Hitler off. Ah, 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 whoa, whoa. I've come to realize, and I didn't know this, a lot of people warned me about this, but conservative ideas, ideas to a lot of people, it's just white supremacism. It goes back, it doesn't go back to God, it goes back uh, to Hitler. It was Hitler evil. Was Jeff uh, Thomas Jefferson evil? No, about switching sides. So he did a complete 180 here, and, and it's funny because he's supposed to be starting a podcast with guys, wow, whoa, whoa. Myron, Elijah Paul Schaefer, Twist. and Nick Fontes. Who all completely disagree with him on this so i don't know if that's gonna happen like nick fun needs to happen needs to happen but guys drink water tonight drink water eat your vegetables and i'll see you in the next one don't watch this video though do not watch this video watch the video on the left man i right, see you there poppy